Hail brothers and sisters, my name is Captain Meatshield, and welcome back to Bioshock Infinite, where we are grabbing stuff, grabbing monies, um, checking things. Ooh, thank you. Um, yeah, we are in the, the Blue Ribbon Restaurant. Um, we've got some things that we need to pick up. Um, sounds full, okay. Uh, machine gun ammo. I haven't even got the machine gun yet. But that's good. But um, we've got these lovely, this lovely couple that seem to be following me around. Or am I following them? I don't know. We do indeed. Why are you following me? We were only here. Why are you following us? Uh, aperitif. Let us see what this aperitif is. It is handy in a pinch. shield the upgrade. Between life and death. Well, I'll appreciate that then. Adds a magnetic repulsive field to improve defense. Okay. Oh. What was that? Surprising. Surprising that it worked? Surprising that it didn't kill him. But a magnetic repulsive field around one's body can come in handy. If it doesn't kill you. A fair point. Yeah, a very fair point. Um, you two are very bizarre. <laughs> uh, what are these things? Infusions. Um, isn't that um, a Twining's tea brand? What's this? Oh, right, health, uh, shield, and salts upgrades. Okay, um... Love that. Better on it. One of those. And we've got more at the bar. So I'll have a shield, uh, a salts one. And... We've got two left. Alright, so... A health and shield one, I think. Ooh, that sounded enthusiastic. Um, right, okay, let's reload that, because I am... I'm still fully loaded up on pistol ammo. Okay, uh, so where am I going? Am I going through... Ooh. Low? Oh, okay. Um, you sink. That's the, uh, the Lady of Columbia, isn't it? Um... I forget her name. Lady Comstock, that's the one. Right, okay. Um, well, you seem to have moved, so thank you. Please don't kill me. <laughs> right. Voxophone. Let's listen to that. Father Comstock called on me today to write his biograph. Me. The man pays for exactly 100 pages in advance. Now, I'm half a Jew when I smell silver, so I say, I say, Father, your flock would pay for a thousand. You know, well, I'd settle for less. And then the prophet looks to me and says, 100 will suffice, as I know how it ends. Well, that doesn't sound fucking ominous, does it? And that guy's voice sounded familiar. I can't quite... I don't know, he sounds like the guy who voiced um, George McFly in the Back to the Future game that I've been playing recently. Sounded very similar to like the kind of accent and the uh, inflection in his voice. Ooh. Oh, that looks like a police car. A police hovercraft or whatever. Alright. Um, who's ringing the bell, anyway? Or ringing the phone? Um, right, we're in the hooks, the docks, I think it said. Ooh. Okay. Where does one go from here? Um. Oh, are you coming up to join us? Or, or do I have to make a... Grab onto a freight hook, look at it, and press space. Oh! Oh! Bloody hell! Must be magnetized. Okay. Oh, fuck. Ooh, I could fall down a very long way from here. Yeah! Skyline strike. Ooh. Alright. Let's try that. Oh! 
Ooh, machine gun. Yeah, boy. E to switch weapons. Reload. Oh, that's a, that's a quick weapon switch. I like that. Um, no machine gun ammo there. Anything left around here that I need to worry about? This looks more like a flamethrower than a bloody machine gun, but sure, I'll take it. Uh, I beg your pardon? Oh, God! Oh! Oh, okay. This thing's effective. I like it. There more? Oh, yeah, there's more. Salt's full. Um, grab anything around here. Uh, beg your pardon? Who said that? I don't see where you are. I ain't for shit, mate. All I did was show up on a bloody rocket. Ooh. Ooh. Fuck. Have that. Really? Oh, that was a robot. I should have possessed that. Ooh, that shield recovers automatically as well. Nice. Great. Who is talking? I can't see anyone. Or are they on the other side of that wall? That's probably what it is, isn't it? Beg your pardon? No, where are you? I can't see shit through all this steam. Ooh. What was that? Oh. <laughs> oh dear. Oh dear. Sorry. <laughs> Don't fuck with me. Yeah, ow, okay, ow, ow, ow. Um, how is it I changed my. There's my possession. Yeah, let's go with you. Um, fuck. Right, thank you. Oh, fuck. Right, there we go. That's, uh, I'm pressing all the wrong buttons now. I'm getting myself all frosted. Uh, oh, God, are they coming back in from behind? They probably are, aren't they? Oh, yep, there we go. No thanks. Oh dear. I think that thing is going after me now. Right, away you go. Don't need you anymore. Oh. oh. Hello, pigeons. Yeah, I'm sure that will help you out. Right. Oh. Now where? Uh, dismount. Okay, do. Is this where I wanted to go? Wanted to go? Did I want to dismount? Or ah, okay. Whoop. In here, I'm guessing. Ooh, the lands down resident residence. Hello? Anybody home? Do I really want to ask that question? Ooh. That's locked. Can I find a key for it? Optional quests give you an opportunity to find valuable resources. Stay alert for a key that may open this chest. Cool. Box of phone. Let's have a listen. Otis works up at the lodge part-time. He took this box from one of their secret ceremonies. And I know for sure, there is something dear inside. Problem is, Otis is more fool than not. He didn't bother to also secure a key from the Feathered Brothers to open the damn thing. Hmm. Oh, hello. You're aggressive. Are you? What does that mean for me? So, I don't know. 
the silver bar. Ooh, that's a lot of money. Okay, well, where do I go from here? Um, so, do I talk to you? How do I talk to you? I don't know. Um, okay, well, it doesn't seem to be much I could do in there. So, right, I'm assuming I need to go elsewhere. Aha! Right. Oh, there we go. So maybe if I find that key, I can head back and open that chest. Be cool. Cool. Ooh, the Montgomery residence. Hello? No. A foregone conclusion. No, I don't suppose it would be, would it? Tim, the one they're after. Go. They're looking for you. I've noticed. Police. We're in need of your assistance. They're here. Shh. Keep your voice down. Don't mind me. I'm just kind of, kind of wander through. See what stuff I can pinch from you. Oh, hello. I suppose you guys have got a key for a chest or anything, do you? The police? Oh, that's good. Uh, what we got down there? That's salts. Don't mind me just pinching all your stuff. I'm gathering a variety of wallets. Uh, I, I need I need the resources, you see. I, it's a very important. Um, Keys. No. Mm. Oh god! Fuck! Ooh, no! Oh, I see where you are. No. Jeez! Fuck! Yeah. God damn it! This is. She's getting busy. Ooh. Wait. Ah, there you are. Oh no. I think it's a fire dude. Yep. Um, okay, okay. I'm getting a little overwhelmed with everybody that's here. If you could just calm down and might not not bother me all that much. Oh hi. Um Oh, there we go. God, that fucking robot is being a pain in the ass. Come here. There we go. Jesus. Oh, bloody hell. That was a pain in the ass. I'm very low on ammunition for bloody everything at the moment. So I'm going to run around and try and find what I can. Ooh, Voxophone. Hello. Gobstock came by the wagon at dawn. Man was just... He just transfixed by my trophy scalps. Asked about the white ones there. I said, well, sir, if your quarry dwells in the jungle and beds down with the local color, why split hairs? <laughs> Not a chuckle out of him. Either he ain't seen a man go native or maybe... Maybe too many. Anyhow, now he's got me hunting down this... Daisy Fitzroy. Hope we don't expect me to stuff and mount her. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so we got an old school cowboy type. He's clearly some sort of mercenary slash bounty hunter for, for Comstock. Sounds like a charming fellow, I must say. Right. Um I think I've managed to get everything. Um, where am I going? Am I going in here? No, I don't think I am. Unless I'm meant to be hopping around on the balconies. Which... I don't know if I fancy attempting, considering how far the fall is going to be. 
I think I need to go over there. Anything in this wreckage? No. <laughs> Great. Ooh. Ordemus Patria Nostra Defender. Defendere. I don't know what that means, but... Comstock fights the Serpent of Nations. Does he? Fraternal Order of the Raven. Okay. All right, I can I can quickly alternate with Q, which is handy. Don't think there's anything outside here that I need to worry about. So, all right, let's see what this Order of the Ravens about. I'm assuming it's something to do with birds, given what I've witnessed just coming in. John Wilkes Booth. What was that? Oh. The sound of so many birds. Hello? Are you gentlemen? Ooh. Uh, sirs, the. F oh dear. Ooh. Can I, can I just uh, have that? Yeah. <laughs> oh God. Right. Let me have that. Um. Who's screaming? Ooh. Who's that? Is that? Oh, I think it was just uh, machine gun stuff. Thought it might have been like a shotgun or something, but. I think the game gave me loads of um, different weapons. Early on, might be asking for a bit much. Box of fun. Come stop. Angel Columbia gave onto the founders the tools to build a new Eden. They did oh dear, so I'm a bit drunk. <laughs> Sounds like a friendly chap. Right, can I turn off this music? Is that going to affect anything? Just makes it very quiet. Okay. What have we got up these stairs? Oh, Big ominous doorway. My favorite kind. And so, the prophet led us into Pesci, where we demonstrated to the sorrow below the true mission our founders have given us. The fuck is going on here? And hypocrites of Washington betrayed him. Our prophet did not heal. He did not come crawling for their forgiveness. Like our fathers broke with the great apostate. Our prophet broke with these so-called patriots. And today is the day we celebrate this secession. Okay. Good for you. A coffin on your back. This is really fucking creepy. Attack! Oh, don't attack. Uh, you guys might want to try... Oh. <laughs> you might want to try guns. They might suit you a bit better. Oh god, okay, I didn't mean it. Come here. Come 
come here. Submit to my shots. Alright, where is this other one? Oh, there's one. He's down here. Got him. There's another one around here somewhere. Where is he? Oh, fuck. I'm a dreadful shot. <laughs> Right, you come here. Oh! Jesus! That's a bit much. Or oh, maybe not enough. <laughs> um, right. Just run around, grab all the stuff that I can get. Where's my loot? Give me the loot, give me the loot. So what's the deal with these guys? This Order of the Raven. Uh, ooh, some fusion, give me that. Nice. Ah, key to the chest. Nice. God, now I've got to go all the way back to go and open that bloody chest now, haven't I? Right. Let's do that then. What exactly was the great emancipator emancipating the Negro from? From his daily bread. From the nobility of honest work. From wealthy patrons who sponsored them from cradle to grave. From clothing and shelter. And what have they done with their freedom? Why, go to Finkton and you shall find out. No animal is born free. Except the white man. And it is our burden to care for the rest of creation. It's a bit obnoxious, don't you think? Um... Something, ain't right. Something definitely ain't right, is it? Oh, fuck. Ooh. Fire. <laughs> right, is there any more of you? I wasn't expecting to have had everybody respawn. <laughs> I like the fact that when people die here, they turn, they transform into boxes full of stuff. <laughs> That's a rather neat thing for pe to, to happen to people. Makes organising the remains very easy. Um, I didn't actually finish exploring like this little corner of everything. I mean, there's not exactly much to explore. Oh, there's some money. Uh, a little bit more money. Now some apples. Right. What's going to be in this chest, then? Oh, that is one hell of a jump. It's impressive. Are you sure you're fully human, Booker? Ooh, there's an infusion. Nice. Uh, give me a little bit more, a little bit more shield. Uh, nice. So it's definitely worth doing those, or going after those chests, and doing like the additional objectives and stuff. Okay. I'm really enjoying the uh, the kind of mobility side of things in this. It's really fun to just kind of throw yourself around. Okay, let's finish getting through this raven cult thing. Okay, what's through yonder doorway? Oh yeah, that's exactly what happened, and wasn't it? Hour, he is considered wholly responsible for causing at least eight God-fearing Colombians to meet their maker in heaven. He is considered brimming with danger and evil intent, and we implore you not to tempt ruination by facing him without aid of Colombia's finest. Yeah, they, they've they've been doing a good job of things so far. All right, I'm gonna take s this elevator somewhere. Elevator that's full of bird shit. Alright, where to? Up or down? I can't actually tell. Oh, up. Probably for the best that it was up.
Oh, what was that noise? Oh, fucking vending machines. It's really eerie and quiet. Oh, hello. <laughs> I think I know where I need to go. Seriously, what's with all these, like, piles? Oh, right, that's film reels. Okay. That's all this about. Native Americans and stuff. The savages. As, as they would most likely have called them. Um, this is some weird, oversized contraption. Uh. Ooh, another Voxer phone. Why do we worship three symbols in your memory? We worship the sword, so that we might avenge you. We worship the raven, so that we might cover the city with eyes. We worship the coffin, because it symbolizes the weight of our faith. this. Let's see what's behind it. Whether this is the way I need to go, or... I don't know, but there's a little box. And I don't like this. What were they keeping in here? Who? New pants. Headmaster increases critical hit damage by 50%. Ooh. Yeah, I like that. So is there a way to see myself dressed in all of the gear, fancy gear that I'm picking up? I'm going to assume probably not. What the fuck? Oh, good lord! And just like that, he's gone. Holy shit. Are you still... You're still alive. Jeez. I'm wondering whether or not I should put you out of your misery. Oh. Can I, can I shut this up? Nope. Why are you giving me that prompt? Do I need to? Alright, let's do that. Where's he coming from? Ooh, found him. And he's dead. <laughs> What's this? A new kind of vigor? Murder of crows. It's a hell of a thing. Alright. Glug, glug, glug. Down in one. I'm gonna turn it into a bird. Hi. Okay. Press to summon murderous crows. <laughs> Hold and release to create a nest trap. Okay. Seems like an interesting, uh, <laughs> interesting thing to use. Uh. Oh. Uh -oh. Well, you ain't nothing but a hound dog. <laughs> oh, I like this. I wish my aiming was better. I could really enjoy this. Have some birds. <laughs> oh, fuck. Well, there we go. That was that. <laughs> Oh, they really outdid themselves with the, um, like, the powers in this one. They probably just, like, game developers probably just sat in a room going, Oh, what, what fun things could we do to murder people? <laughs> Burning Halo. 70% chance that a melee target is set ablaze. Victim takes 300 damage over 4 seconds. 
compared to electric punch or burning halo. I'm going to go with burning halo. Yeah. I think is that what I've got equipped? I can't How do I how do I check my gear? Aha, there we are. Right, gear. I've got Have I got burning halo equipped? I think I do. Ooh, there's quite a few guns that are available here, which is good. I've got Vigors, which are all upgradable as well, and those are all my Voxophones. All right, cool. Glad I know what button I need to access that. The false shepherd, this anarchist, is either a mulatto dwarf or a Frenchman with a missing left eye. No more than four foot and nine inches. Okay, I don't think I need to worry about them finding me then. <laughs> I can get to Monument Island from that station. Ooh. Go to the gondola station. Alrighty, let's do that. Hop! Oh, dismount. Yes. Well, where is the gondola station? Right down there, I think. But I should go down here and just check to see what I can find. It's always worth exploring. to something. Sorry, I don't mean to... Ooh. Okay. Who are you calling trash? Are you even shooting at anybody? Bloody hell. <laughs> okay. Are they drawing a picture of Andrew Ryan? So it looks. So it looks like. Uh, right, I'll search you. Um, hello, madam? Sorry, I don't. I didn't mean to barge in and cause all this trouble. Um, I was just looking around for stuff, and you know, things got in the way. I'll leave you to your business. Hop. Ooh. That's a long way to fall. I'm glad I can't see the ground below. Mind you, if I pass through those clouds, I definitely will be able to see it. So. Ooh. <laughs> Oh, let's get him. Oh! I'll tear your head off. Will you? Don't think you will. I can certainly do with improving my aim, though. So, you know. Be glad that I didn't kill you quite so quickly. I don't know. Loaded up on pretty much everything I can. This place is apparently off limits. Guess better go in. Uh, yes. Oh, good, okay. Okay. Um, this seems like a fairly good spot to leave things. Going into a new area. We've got new weapons. We've got new vigors. We've got lots of things to play with. And I'm already seeing police. Uh, but this is good fun. I'm really enjoying this. The, the movement just feels so slick and fluid and yeah, this is great. I'm really enjoying this. So I'll be picking this up again as soon as I possibly can. So for now I'm going to wrap this episode up here and just say thank you all so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, check out the playlist on the channel for more Let's Plays or Metal Covers and give this video a like or a comment just to leave your thoughts. And if you wish to join the ever-growing ranks of the Order of the Shield, be sure to hit that subscribe button, or maybe follow me on Twitch. 
Or maybe even consider checking out my Patreon and becoming an officer within the ranks. But thank you again for watching this video, and I will catch you all very, very soon. This is Captain Meatshield, signing off. Posing creature made of Lego. <laughs> um, I have no armed forces whatsoever. What are you going to do? Are you going to just leave me alone?